Hi, what's up? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you're new, my name's Lauren. I just got home from getting my hair done. I was taking some pictures of my ring light. I don't know if any of them will make it to Instagram, but anyways, um, I just did something different with my hair. I usually do baby lights all over, but I switched it up and I did a root tap and then a money piece. So those are like really blonde pieces that frame your face. I just hated how my hair looked after it grew out after a few weeks and um, it had that harsh line. So the root tap makes it less harsh when your hair grows out. So I love it. She did such a good job. I go to Jess at Stella Luca Salon, the Winter Park Village one if you live in the Orlando area. She is really good. I've been going to her for a year now and she always does a good job and kills it and just understands hair. So I will link her Instagram down below if you want to book an appointment or I'll post the salon site down below as well. Yeah, go to her if you're in need of a new stylist. Anyways, it's 5.30, I'm really hungry. I am probably about to snack on some Trader Joe's jalapeno and artichoke dip. It's so good. So I'm gonna do that. I also got an inch taken off the ends, which was needed because they were just so dry and they needed to be chopped. But anyways, okay. I didn't drink enough water today. Okay, we just pulled up to Shake Shack. It's the next day. I didn't really vlog this morning. I was editing a video that I posted today and I started my work week in my life video and I've barely made a dent in it. Just a lot of footage that I have to go through. It's like over 110 clips from last week and it was only a four day week. So I could only imagine if I worked on yesterday on Friday and how long that video would have been. But um, we're just getting a really late lunch at Shake Shack. It's like three o'clock, it's 3.15 or something, 3.20. So we're doing that and then we're going to a gun range, which I don't think I've ever shot a gun before, so I'm kind of nervous, or been to a gun range. Maybe I have, but I can't remember. So yeah, that's what's going on. Honey, try one of those, please. Yeah. I still can't believe they told me to come in here and shoot my three of them. Same. 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 No, you should be pulled out on this one. It is. Good job, see? This is how you do it. It's out of bullets. Oh yeah, 
still got the uh, pump. You didn't pull out the pump yet. I only got 50 grams. Oh, I have another like 200. Mm -hmm. yeah. gonna look at them on the computer but when we first we just left the gun range when we first got there I almost started like tear I was tearing up because the people next to us had psycho absolute psycho guns like there's just no need to go to people that bring guns that big need to be in their own separate room away from people that are delicate and have never shot a gun before <laughs> it was loud and it would like shake my my chest it was just weird but anyways I shot a gun for the first time I'll insert a picture right here of what the target looks like because I took a picture of it and I did get some good shots so that's good but yeah, headshots but kill shots because I got some that were in the chest too it was scary and it was loud and it's a lot to wear glasses and that those earmuffs that like push on your glasses and then a mask you just feel like suffocated hi can I do um, a venti iced coffee with vanilla sweet cream cold foam on top. Oh my gosh. You know it's a good day when you have enough points to get a free Starbucks. Okay, it is a little bit later in the day, actually a lot bit later in the day. Christian and I went to the grocery store and got a couple things because we are doing a little Super Bowl get together at our place, which we've never hosted anything here, so I'm a little excited. So I went to Party City, I'm gonna show you what I got from Party City, and I'm gonna show you what I've been, sorry, Christian's on the phone. I'm gonna show you what I've been um, cooking, making, and all that good stuff. So I'm gonna show you what I got from Party City. I'm making little pigs in a blanket right now, I'm just in the process of it, so I'm gonna finish that. But I got this tray, we're gonna put chips on it. I got this little, dip bowl i made a dip in the crock pot so it's like a slow cooker dip that i'm gonna put in that football tray for the pigs in a blanket i'm gonna stab them with these little toothpicks and i got <laughs> these little things that stand up from party city as well oh there's more of these little figures over here and when I was checking out the woman goes are you who are you rooting for and I said I'm a Bucks fan Big Bucks. so so she gave me a free balloon she gave me two but one of them right when I got in my car it started deflating I could hear it like deflating out so just one and um, I got just a tablecloth because our table isn't the most expensive table and it could easily get destroyed by a wet glass. We put this tray here. And yeah, that's that's everything. I'm gonna finish making these. They're really good. They're brushed with Dijon mustard. I'm gonna brush them with egg too. And um, these are the chips that we got to go with the dip. We're just gonna finish these off. These are really good from Trader Joe's. I wish I had some decor to put in my drink. 
Cheers. Okay, I set everything up. This is how they turned out. We haven't tried it yet, but they look really good. Got these Girl Scout cookies. The dip and the chips. I think it turned out so cute. Try again.